Today I'm going to demonstrate the uses of layouts, all right? And this is a good way of setting up your your document so that you can look at it from different views very, very quickly without going back and changing the view. All right, so what we're going to do is, you may notice where it says Model, and you click on Layout, this is what's going to print. That's a top view, all right? And you can see all the numbers and everything. You see Kevin's name, all right? And then if you click Layout 2, you notice they're both identical. Now, what you can do is you can go to your model, and I'm going to go view, uh, view, I'm sorry, 3D view, and I'm going to go say southeast isometric. All right, so you have a southeast view. Now, the command tool, I'm just going to type in layout. I'm going to hit enter, and it's going to say, what option do you want? And I'm just going to put, um, why don't we call this uh, new. So I'm going to create a whole new layout. And what do I want to call it? And I want to call this perspective. All right, and now you notice I have a, a layout here, a new tab is shown up that says perspective. And when I click on this, this is now rated print as a perspective view. All right, very handsy, handy little tool. Okay, it allows us to move quickly between the two different layouts that I want to see. Top view, layout one, top. Layout 2 is, uh, is also top and perspective. Also, if you want to delete something, since I really don't need two top layout views, I think I'm just going to right-click on Layout 2 and delete that layout. Good. So now I just have a top and perspective. Very handy for when you want to be able to print more than one thing. 